Hey everybody! I'm here today to show you and tell you how to memorize the periodic table. I'll be going over the fastest way possible to memorize the periodic table. Let's get right into the video. When I was in high school, I had memorized the entire periodic table. And I was by no means a scholar, but I ended up memorizing it. Now, what is this paper that I'm holding? Well, this is just a representation of the periodic table. You don't need to actually see what's on it until you have it in front of you um, at your own home or in your own location where you're studying. But I just drew this to sort of give you an example, okay? Um, this is the method that I use. It's called progressive memorization, okay? And what it means is you're memorizing things in a progressive way. You're not just studying the whole thing, you're progressively building. It's Imagine like you're building a, a house from blocks, like a toy house from blocks. You're gonna build it each step at the each step at a time but now we're going back with every step that's the idea so basically you're going to have uh you know elements on your periodic table it's a periodic table of elements you're going to start off with your first element you're going to see what it is and the short form for the element okay just one time that's it whatever it is okay then you're going to do the first two so you're going to do the first two elements okay say what they are and the short form okay then you're going to do the first three so you're gonna do the first three elements, say what they are, each of them, and the short form. What you'll notice is every time that you say the like the, the earlier ones, you're gonna get better at it. So by the time that you're at five or 10 elements in, let's say you're 10 elements in, your one, two, three, and four are gonna be absolutely memorized, okay? And then it will start to get more difficult when you're like 20 elements in, let's say, because then you have a lot more to memorize. But what you'll notice is when you start having some difficulty, certain ones you're gonna remember where they are, usually the outside ones, and then the ones beside the ones that you easily memorize. Maybe something, you know, you memorize because you can relate to it. The ones beside it, you're gonna be able to remember easily. Um, um, but what you want to do is when you start having some difficulty, get a highlighter and highlight the ones that you're struggling with, okay? Once you start seeing that you have, let's say, five, five of them, roughly, that you're struggling with, stop. Stop doing the progressive memorization and go study those five that you're struggling with. Study their locations. Study their short form. Study their number. Study, study their name. Visualize it, okay? Study them. Then try again. And you'll notice that out of the five that you were studying, you'll probably get two or three of them that you can get easily. And the, the remaining, you know, two or three of them that are left over, um, you're still going to have difficulty with. Continue progressively memorizing. Continue. When you struggle with another five, let's say, like let's say the two that you couldn't get before plus three more, okay? So you five that you, you're having difficulty with. Stop study them, okay? What's going to happen is you're going to continue getting better and better. Um... If you use this method, you should easily be able to memorize the vast majority of the elements on the periodic table in a matter of a couple of hours, okay? And then if you take a break, let's say you stop, you know, if your test is tomorrow, you're probably gonna have to be happy with getting like 90, knowing 90, 95% of them. But if you wanna know every single one, then stop, take a break, the next day go back at it and you're probably only gonna have let's say five to ten that you struggle with study those and you should be good okay what i'm trying to say is like if you use this method in one day you'll probably be able to memorize in a few hours you'll be able to memorize 90 95 percent of the elements if you want to memorize every single one just wait for that second day do the last five to ten percent that you're struggling with and you'll get them down and that's it you should be good that is how to memorize a periodic table in the fastest way possible it worked for me it's worked for many others i've recommended this method to many people they say that it works very very well so i figured that i would make a video about it because i know there are a whole bunch of you out there that are trying to memorize the periodic table whether you, you want to know it or whether it's for a test this is the way to do it if you like this video please be sure to give it a thumbs up let me know what you think down below as a comment and of course be sure to subscribe subscribe for more great videos just like this one. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.